So instead, uh, we're just going to jump straight into it. Welcome to part two of Life is Strange True Colors. Let's see if it's actually going to give her a, like, rewind of what just happened. Nope, it's just going to jump straight into chapter two. Okay, uh, in that case, our brother just got chucked off a cliff after, well, we were tied together, because that some asshole just cut the wire. And so he fell off the cliff. I'm not big on speeches. I've always believed that the role of the bartender is to shut up and listen. And by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. I never issued a speeding ticket to someone on a bicycle before until he came along. He cared so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. <laughs> he booked my band to play the lantern all the way from Seattle to pretty much right where I'm standing. I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. <laughs> the first was two years ago. So, long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. I'm sure there were more people, but I only remember him. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then the fifth time he cared he's about going everyone. over everyone he was the kind of guy you wanted to be around he was a world class bullshitter he was my best friend All I want to say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger, but he left it as family. <clears throat> Guess that's that then. What happened to Gabe? was a senseless, tragic accident. It wasn't an accident. And I just that wish asshole. It wasn't an accident. Cut the rock. Son, cut the line. Now was not the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now... Now Gabe's dead. Brian, you could have just, you know, not cut the rope. That, that would have done shift. it too. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. Nobody called. I don't believe you, Mac. You're lying. <laughs> In front of Gabe's own fucking sister, Alex heard the whole thing. Not quite. I didn't hear the other end. Well, I didn't. I didn't hear Gabe make the call. But he told us he got through. Well, if Gabe said something, then I'm inclined to believe him, Mac. What are you saying? I'm not saying anything. Just, I didn't get a call. Draw your own conclusions. All right, folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about that... we review the sequence of events, hmm? Well, son. When I saw you at the record store, you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. 
Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. Just saying. Pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved his life? Look, I told you there was no call to miss. Okay, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit, I mean, it's not like... It's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable all the time. You watch yeah, your I mouth, don't believe Mac. you, right, Mac, that's but... Now, I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son, but there was a time... Bullshit, and... Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. No, I am just telling you. Mac, I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time... Stop it! Stop it now! I'm gonna get infected by one of these pretty soon. This is not the time or place. We're all here for Gabe. Okay, Ryan? Sure, I'm... I'm sorry. It's not... I'm just... I'm not the one who killed him. <laughs> you did cut the rope. I'm not saying you're Why guilty, you but like, what the? You're not fuck innocent did you either. Say? Ryan, back off. Oh, hell. I'm just saying. I thought I heard that you Mac, were the one. You shut the hell up. No, no. Go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's fucking hear Come it. Come on, guys. Don't make me intervene. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. He he did. Why not That's you? That's it. Wait's over. But it's not like one person was at fault for this. <sighs> and to be completely honest, I'm not sure if he's dead because we didn't see Alex? his body. Hey, fuck those guys. Yeah. Are you okay? No. God, no. I'm a fucking wreck. It's not your job to keep it together. Thanks. Do you, um... It's messy, but do you want to come in? Sure. You play guitar? Yeah, well, sort of. I used to. Cool. This Gabe would try awkward. to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. Till he wiped out. That was hilarious. Did he draw mustaches on the... Gabe really wanted to do the LARP for Ethan. But by the end of it... He was more jazzed about it than anybody. Wish I could have seen it. Yeah. 
We took this a year ago. We... Done. No way. I can't. What? He actually kept it. Why can't I see like my Whatever own Whatever that aura. bottle made her think of, it really messed her or up. Alex's aura, so I can. I be, wonder like, if I could help her the same character. way I helped Ethan. You wonder if you I can. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. This is a terrible plan, but okay. What's really going on with Steph? Okay, so there's a bunch of things that are causing emotions. Let's start with the foosball table. It seems the most prevalent. <laughs> Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 mm. bucks. they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm. Badass. A band called the Don't Shit on My Yard. Okay. Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww. <laughs> Is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. Stephen Gabe had Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. Is that everything? I think so. Steph? Sorry. This is so embarrassing. I just need some time. Okay. Hmm. Wait, what can I do then? I need to find out why Steph is so upset. I mean, did you not just pay attention to that? That was all four, I think. Was it? Because there's the, the table, the record, the game, and the bottle. What am I missing? These auras around the apartment should tell me what's going on. Yes, I'm... Oh, wait, there's one more. Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, you have to figure didn't out I tell you? Steph upset. I'm not you're taking it. Because Gabe's I moved dead. to Denver or next week. You think Gabe's you dead. what? I think I know enough to help her now. And she was planning on no, so she was planning on leaving, but still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. He's the whole reason I'm still... 
I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. Mm. Start with the foosball. Table. How about a quick match? Did Gabe tell you we played? Yeah. And he said he kicked your butt. <laughs> Asshole. I don't really think it's a great time. That might have been the wrong thing. Fine. First to five points? If you say so. Oh, it's actually gonna be. So, how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You must be pretty good then. Mm hmm. You were in a band, right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. I'm focusing way too how, hard. Uh, how long did you play with them? <sighs> too long. I'm really crap at this, by the way. Gotcha. Did you kill somebody? No, it was Gabe, remember? Did you watch the... Did I watch the what? Did you watch the recap? I definitely didn't because I was having food. I just beat stuff five to zero. Five points! That's game! I probably yep. should let her win though. Big shocker. Oh hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No, I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. I've never Our let skill. somebody win. Timing. Unless there's a chance of getting laid. And the will to be a champion. <laughs> Unless there's a- oh. wait, what? Is that how it is? Need I repeat it? Okay, I don't okay. think so, but like, that's, Joking that's aside, a terrible plan. Playing this stupid game with you is exactly uh, it, it, what it's I need right now. Honestly. Why else would you let somebody win? You're on. Oh dear. I'm actually trying this time, so you better focus. I am focusing. Legitimate Good. Why I don't want you to get distracted win. or anything. Certainly not. Yeah, I'm getting the hang of it at least. Greatest Northwest band of all time, go. <laughs> Are you trying to distract me? Oh, of course not. Oh. Slater Kinney, if you were wondering. You're bad. No, I missed one. She just let that one go in. Okay. Woo! Shit. Oh, that's a win. I was actually trying that time. <laughs> Okay, wait, wait, wait. There you are. Let's get serious. One oh, more no. game. Winner takes title of ultimate foosball champion. Mm, I don't know. Come on. You know, Gabe would be all about us playing like this. Well, oh, then it's still alive. Okay, I'm still gonna try at least, but like. <laughs> this is it for all the marbles. How so much many of marbles? this game is playing Definitely the kind of game you want to focus on, no matter what happens. Totally. That was close. Okay. I'm about to say you're bad. No, I didn't let it go hey, in. So are you into girls or what? I, I realized that. Wait, before. what? <laughs> yeah. Girls are pretty rad, right? Especially girls that play foosball and host radio stations and wear beanies like it's a religion. Oh. <laughs> Sounds like a winning combo. You're bad. Well, were you listening to the conversation at all? 
No. <laughs> Snap literally just asked if I'm in the girl. Who's what? What? Fuck. Or trash. <laughs> I knew this it. Is, this is for old How models, old are you man. exactly? Good. Old enough to know better. Oh. That's <laughs> turning it on. Just stop being brash. Oh. No. You're gonna lose this and I'm gonna laugh Probably. at you. Lost Wooseball to an AI. Yep. It literally is just four months. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm fucking done. finally! You're, you're trash. The house of Chen crumbles at last! But she's not feeling sad anymore, at least, so. Like, that Depression. was the goal. Good game. Thank you. You're a much better loser than Gabe. Weird. That's no fun. Yeah, that was kind of weird, but... Sorry to spoil the victory. <laughs> the point here is trying to make Seth feel better. It looks it's kind like of crazy that you knew exactly what would cheer me part. up. Uh-oh. Uh, Don't give me too much credit. I'm the one who really needed it. So, what are you gonna do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? Oh. Uh. I'm not okay, so, I don't know how much you know about what happened last time, but... Um, literally nothing. Okay, so... I wasn't here. Remember how the kid was going to the mine, right? And he didn't die because you made the wrong choice, yeah. No, no, so he went to the mine regardless. Ended up stuck on the far side of a ravine. So we tied ourselves to our brother to go across the ravine and save the kid, which we did. Why? I told you to let him die. Well, there was no other choice, okay? Like, that's how the game had to progress. But the mine was also scheduled to have an explosion that day, right? Gabe said he called the mine and asked them to delay it, and they said that they would in order to find the kid first before they, you know, blew up some explosive charges near where he might be. But as we finished getting the kid back across the ravine, the explosions went off anyway, which caused a rock slide uh. right towards us. And in order to save us from the rock slide... Ryan cut the rope after Gabe had fallen into the ravine. Died. Meaning Gabe is missing or dead. We didn't uh -huh. find a body. God damn it. And now there's like, we're trying to figure out who's at fault. Because Mac, the guy that we got in a fight with, was working yeah, at the is. mine. And was the one who supposedly received that call. But he's claiming that he didn't get a call at all. App. But some people are also blaming Ryan because he cut the rope that was holding you and Gabe together. No, it's Max fault. He's full of shit. It. Uh, we're not sure yet, though, because I have to go and like investigate. Not sure what more. Max deal is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. I'll I've got just verify. Okay, sure the this is this is dead. a wild theory, but what if this was a kidnapping plot for Gabe? Why? Where both Mac and Ryan were working together. For what reason? To Well, Gabe apparently has a lot of effect on the world around. Right? Mac is already upset at Gabe because he thinks Gabe is she is with his girlfriend, right? So Mac has a reason. I'm not sure if Ryan does. Wait, 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 wait. Gabe isn't the annoying child? No. Gabe's the 
our brother. Oh, wait, he's a brother, right? Yes, he's okay. dead or missing. Okay, well, Max Bullshit, it was, um, he, he, killed, he tried to kill Gabe uh, because, yeah. And, that um, that might Ryan's be innocent. the solution, but there's no way it's that simple. Right? Like, it, there's no way it's going to be that simple. No it matter definitely. what. Thank you. I'm wondering if it was a lot. kidnapping plot between Ryan and Mac. And Why someone else. Instead of I should head back to work. Well, because cool. no body was found. So did they yeah, intentionally like, get him off the cliff and away from me so that they could fake his death and kidnap him? The problem is, I don't know what the motive him? would be for that. Yeah, but like, why kidnap him instead of just kill him and chuck him in a river? I don't know. It's because, well, we have powers. If they know that, or do they know that does he also have powers? That's a good question. Bye. At least we Bye. made Steph feel better, though. But it's time to go into detective mode, isn't it? <laughs> I know Gabe made that call. The only important thing Mac right now is revenge. The blast go off just to get back at him. I get a few. Hold on. You could stay here too. I wouldn't try to stop you. Yeah, good. I'll be the only trans person in a town with a population of like four. That sounds like a blast for me. Thanks for not trying to stop me. I'm sorry, Izzy. It's not you. And it's not the band. I fucking love that shit. But I need to try this. It's just time for something new. Because we know Steph used to be part of a band in I Seattle. knew it. I knew this would happen eventually. Fucking see you around, Steph. Town yeah, does look really nice, doesn't it? It's so. It's not like drab and boring like most video games. It's actually, like, colorful. Notes? Alex, I'm having a small event for your brother tomorrow at 9. I'd love to have you there, but no pressure, okay? You take all the time you need. Jed. Let me know if you need any groceries. I'll cover the cost. Thanks, Jed. Sorry, apartments yours as long as you need it. If you know where to find me if anything comes up, yeah. Well, at least Jed seems like a decent guy. There's no way he did it. Unless. Unless. I highly doubt it, to be honest. It just wouldn't make sense with what we know about the character. But, like, this is his wake, right? If it was supposed to be like a proper wake and they found his body, it would be here. Well, at least pick up the chair. Oh, hey, kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. Wanted to apologize. For all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake, and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. Max fault or a pre Definitely. Just that everybody Max against Mac. That everybody against Mac. They're all gonna kill him. Thanks, Jed. But it wasn't your Someone's fault. following. Oh, Max started. Uh, hey, Evac D. Carm. Hello, yeah, and welcome to exactly the stream. I didn't exactly stop it, though, either, did I? I don't know if you've played the Life is Strange series at all. I'm sure Gabe would have You know about what happened, like, here. in the first episode? I could tell he really loved this place. Asking how you are, I don't think he cares about the game. <laughs> I'm alright. Does that... He added you on Discord and had a great day, so he pretty much just came. How bad do you have to be at darts? To, to do that. Like, the dartboard's all the way over here. <laughs> Why don't you try it and find? <laughs> I love that little detail. 
Okay, let's go and... Well, there was two things. The dispensary and the flower shop. Right? You're asking me like I was paying attention. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't really paying attention either. We probably should have done go that. Go to wherever Mac is and kill him. Go to wherever Mac is and just kill him. I mean, I did already punch his shit in earlier, so... Okay, that is Jed true. said now I might do it find again. Mac in the flower shop. Okay, so I have time to swing shop. by the dispensary if I want. Okay, so visit Steph at the record store and visit the dispensary. Uh, I can also okay. apparently see what Ike's emotions are. Game was too young, just too young. Maybe we can. Hey, Pike. Hey. Um, how are you holding up? I've been better. Guess I've been this better. This is pretty bad for Alex, huh? Yeah, right. Dumb question. Hey, Shit. I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah, that's what everyone's been saying. And, uh, when you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. Doing my own. Max a liar. I can just straight up say Max a liar to the police. Do it. But I have Please. no proof, you know? Fine. Go find your proof and then come back and tell him he's full of shit. I'll, I'll be ready soon. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. Yeah. No rush. I could have told the Max a liar, but I don't have the ability to rewind time here, so. It's ring by the dispensary? It's bullshit. Is there any way to buy a hat? I need to know what's happening to our jobs. Is there any way to buy a hat? You, guys you want, don't think anything's you want really Alex to wear a hat? Right? Like, is yeah. that bad? It's hard to say. Oh, her hair is fine. Oh. It's just that when it, whenever. Right, when, whenever uh, Mac's name around. gets pulled up, she's going to take off the hat and wave it around and start yelling, Cap. It's a shit situation. <laughs> but the least well, there, there was an outfitter shop there, but it doesn't look like it'll let me do anything there. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. No, go to the flower shop, confront Mac. I'm not going straight there. There are some, like, side things here. We, like, we should visit Steph in the do dispensary. You no, you visited Steph already. Week? I, I'm sure. at least doing it. Or something. Saw her like five ago. Oh, just sorry. Confront Matt. Kill him. We met briefly. Her. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Yep. Alex, yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. Diane's the one suit. Wait a minute. Diane was the suit for the mining company, wasn't she? Yeah, I think so. The mining company set off the charges, though. I definitely don't think she did it. Charlotte? Alex? Hey. Jed said you wanted to see me? I just wanted to see how you were doing. Staying busy. I've been trying to stay busy mostly. Yeah. Distractions help. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. I hear he's been having a rough time. Might the yeah, it was kind of his fault because he's a stupid kid. Lost father. He's also just a kid. Though. I know you don't care. like it's him, but his fault. he's never done that before. Does that mean we should press charges on a kid? No, but he should live with the guilt that he killed his almost father. 
Stay strong. You'll get through the hard parts. Both of you. Easier said than done, huh? Yeah. No shit. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death Escape. Well, that's a hold on. What look look behind her. Is that an alien bong? An affidavit. It is from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. An affidavit from Typhon. If she a big one. How about? That's shady. You hold off on that. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? They say it's an offer of good faith. But you're right. Uh, He's dead because of them. And I'd be letting them off. Are you going to sign it? But you hold out. Wait, like. I don't know. I don't know. Two in game days because that's first, usually how long evidence collecting takes. And then you can break two days what would you and then do? see. Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Uh you should get something. Well, cause she needs the money for Ethan though, but she does also uh, like own a store. So I don't think she needs the money that much. Unless the store is doing badly because there's like two people in the town. True. But, like... Why won't it let me select the other one? The illusion of choice gives us the illusion of power. Yeah, like, what do you... They wouldn't be offering you money if they didn't fuck up somewhere along the line. That, is that or they're just trying to avoid a lawsuit in general. Which would get you more money, probably. Which would get you more money anyway. But the thing is, can she afford a lawyer that would actually fight that case good enough to get a proper payment? True. That's where you come in. I'm, I don't think Alex is a lawyer, but... No, but, like, evidence and shit. I'm gonna recommend to turn the offer down, because... I don't think it's a recommend, I think it's a yes or no. Like, I want Alex to recommend it, but, like, of course that's gonna influence her entire decision, because Alex is the protagonist. Business standpoint, you, you could stand it. to make a lot of more money. I'm sorry. I know it's hard, but you can't let Typhon buy you, you off. You don't want to make money off of someone dying, though. Gabe made that call, and I'm going to prove it. We don't want Typhon to just pay you off to avoid some time. jail time. Well, here's the thing, right? Thanks for you, being You honest. could get paid off, and they could get jail time. True, if we go this route. If they're willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, it's a pretty big brain if you think about it. hiding something. I really appreciate you stopping by. Feel free to take a look around if you want. Of course, she's oh, right. I'm going to. But I could really use that money. We can't give in, no matter how hard it is. I've never been in a store like this that had anything like. Glass pipes so. are so cool. That is bullshit. They're like works of art that can also get you high. You have to do that or voice in your own head, Alex. Like, really? It made this probably a bong on your floor. Sweet logo. I Bet honestly Charlotte have never been herself. in any store like this. So. Probably cost more than my bus ticket. Look at the one that's like an alien, though. <laughs> She has an ATM and everything, but yeah, I think that's enough for now.
Now, where else were we going to go? Oh, right, the record store. Their Steph house. asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. Oh, whichever one right. kills Mac is fine with me. But E guy who's also... Hold on. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. It's hard Let's to not be give a shit about music. anything that's going on but right now. I ignore him. find something around here to cheer him up. Oh, there she is. I'm glad Gabe convinced her to stay. Well, it's also on air, so I really shouldn't knock, but... You really shouldn't. Haven's favorite and only Go elsewhere. choice for modern rock. Yeah, I'll, I'll wait first, because this, this hoodie guy is looking for breakup music. Let's see if we can find anything. Maybe there should... Chrissy left him because he's ugly. Ow. He's clapped. <laughs> you have to be that rude, huh? Look, that's how females are, alright? That's how it'd be. I don't think so, but... but mm, hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I'm only gonna set, sure? but... What kind of saints have you been talking about? Have you talked to Ethan at all? He's taking it really hard. Nothing? But what okay. you did for me this morning got me thinking... Oh, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. What if Ethan needs something like that, too? Something fun and distracting. Uh, I was asking, what kind Something of saints like have you been talking about? They're not, not just like, like the one eh, you're Gabe ugly, gonna take I don't him to. Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. We're making a LARP for the guy that cut the rope? I want it to be as good rope? as it can be. Ethan gave you one of uh, his comments, right? No, it's Ethan, not Ryan. Never mind. So, what do you think? Also cringe as fuck. Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating. Obviously, it's Storm right The there. one with the large dong. There is like. Obviously, it's Storm right there, the undead. That's the one with the large dong. Storm Rider looks like a worthy opponent. He gets my vote. <laughs> Alright then. Oh, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Oh. Okay, so stuff in the what book? Oh no, hey, stop offering to do jobs. Go kill people. With their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block oh, of indie rock. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. Oh, okay. A bard that's a half elf that has distortion field or guess I'm in. Let's start with my name. The spring festival is just around the corner. Sponsored by What do you think for the name? The mission is free this year, so Alto or Alexandra. Hell, bring your ass. That's basic as hell. What? Alexandra is basic as hell, it's just like her full name. So, Alto. Yeah, sure. Alto is a good name for a bard. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. What do you think? Distortion field or healing... I'm not even sure how to pronounce it. Serenade, is that what you said? Serenade. Which do you think? Well, which one sounds more like a bard thing to you? To be honest, I don't know what a bard is. They're the ones with, like, the musical instruments, right? Imagine a singing newspaper, but, like, in the Dark Ages. A singing newspaper in the Dark Ages. Yeah, that's a bard. Okay. Healing Serenade it is. How did I meet Thanor? Something, it's gotta be something funny. A wolf and an ogre walk into a bar. Uh, oh god. This LARP thing just might work. That was cringe. <laughs> a wolf and an ogre walk into a bar. Seriously. Okay, I think we're done. There should be a feature where you could just slap somebody in the face and say, you just posted cringe. You know, when you design a video game, you can do that, and I will do it to every NPC possible. Still need to check the flowers.
I have time, a lot of money. Time. A lot of time, I'll do that. Shop for Mac. Alright, flower shop time. Eleanor? Oh! <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> no crash, need to apologize. Kill the old woman. That's not your target. <laughs> kill someone by just How are you, dear? In. Oh. The old woman is not your target. I'm, um. Adjusting. I I'm okay. I'm okay, I guess. Taking it one moment at a time. It's the best way to be. I don't think it is, but... Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Damn it. Oh, can't have gotten too far. <laughs> oh, you should have gone straight there. Thanks. I don't think that would have no, made I'm a sorry. difference, but... Oh. The old lady has Alzheimer's. <laughs> kind of scary. What is she though? Has Alzheimer's. Maybe. Or dementia. But... She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. Can I not? Come on. It won't let me... We're trying to, like, figure out what's wrong and how to help him. He has dementia. I, th I think it's pretty obvious. Okay. Time to figure out why she's afraid. Wait, why she's afraid? And it's just the cash register. All my memories, All my memories are, fading. are fading. I feel, I feel broken. broken. Brain is going, old woman. Alzheimer's, yeah, you're probably right. If they know, if they about, know my about my condition, they'll make me close, make this, me place. close this place. Oh dear, that that's not good. The doctor said I had more time, but. Everything is becoming so out of order. Oh dear. No, there's still something else that I'm missing. Let's see, we already got that. And we got the sign. What are we missing? How old is the protagonist? How old is Alex? I don't know. Uh, didn't say? Okay. I'm sure it's somewhere, but... If Ryan finds right out, out... She can't, she can't find, find out. If Riley finds out... There's some sort of medical... Yeah, she has Alzheimer's or she Thank has dementia, you. one of the two. We'll get started on it right away. Just come by with the check whenever you're free. Holy shit. No, she's she's just yes, yeah, definitely some kind of memory problem. It might be Alzheimer's, but it might be something else. Oh dear. Why did the phone change, by the way? It's not just that she forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. But how can I help her? That, that's a good question. Rain how, how can I help her? You really, you really just can't. You just kind of... Wait, just click like, help, and that helps them. Forget what you were working on? <laughs> could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. Hmm. Retrace your steps or ask Riley, your daughter? 
Retrace your steps. Don't ask Riley. Riley can't find out. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Oh, I don't want to keep you. Hey. What happened to... I... I want to help. Okay, so... Okay. What would Eleanor have done first? Lilies? I don't know what first would be. I'm assuming that's starting with the sign. Or the... The G sign? Sure. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in. And then I open my mail. Something must have distracted me. Better. We can do this. Something must have distracted her. Um, like a phone call. You think that might have been it? Mm, I don't know, maybe. Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. It was Mac. I can't think who it was. I don't think it was Mac. Maybe we can find something to remind you. Thing was Mac. Find something to remind you. Well, there's that. Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Oh, goodness. Yes. What was the order for? I'm assuming flowers, because you do work in a flower shop. Like, lilies, right? I hope I'm getting this order right. Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. Is the register the another thing I can collect? Last. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. Should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan. Huh. Leaf flowers, $89. Arrangement in standing basket. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. Yay! Hey, clearly not this. Still there. I couldn't have done it without you. Seriously, Alex, you're a godsend. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. God. She doesn't I remember. remember that. A funny story. <laughs> A funny story? No! <laughs> Not telling her that. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Tell do her it, about game. Well, I mean, we should tell her do about it, game. Do it, do it, do it. I just want to see her reaction. It's going to be so funny. This is going to be yeah, terrible. I, I hope she says well, funny story. <laughs> no. You better not. They were... They were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Gabe's wake? Oh no! I... Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alex. 
Thanks. Little dot strike point. Little dot strike point. Little dot strike point. I'm so sorry. Hey, it's um. Excuse me. <laughs> What are you storming out for? This was your fault. I shouldn't have told her that. Okay. I feel so bad that now. Sucked. But like, I, have at been asked. least I told her the truth. Remember something, jeez. Yes, but I can't like, I can't lie to her, can I? I mean, uh, it's not like she'd remember it. That yeah, but... poor young man. <laughs> How did I forget? I'm so sorry, Eleanor. It would have been worse to lie, though. Eleanor said Mac is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge? Anyone have a good advice for taming stray cats? Found this- OH NO! <laughs> Wait. <laughs> that's, an, that's a mountain lion cub. Be very careful, they can be aggressive when threatened. Try leaving a door open and it will leave on its own. And he's under my bed. <laughs> uh. <laughs> that's that's not great. Welcome Jack Stevens, who will be taking you over to the restaurant next to the park. Looking for a new adventure in Haven? DM me if All she sent was like pictures of three buttons. Also, why is Steph's picture like slightly cross-eyed? Do you see that? Not really, no. Hold on. I'll have to get it bigger because I'll, I'll get it in like 4K. Hold on. You know I'm going to end up turning this into an emo, right? Probably. Just our picture is slightly cross-eyed. It's great. There's Ethan. Oh dear. Everyone needs to stop telling me it's okay. It's not. Fuck. Yeah, I don't deal with Losing the child. Gabe's been hard enough for a supposed. Did. Push hey, him in the river. I'm not pushing him yeah, in the river. Why are you talking to the child? Oh, don't tell him if he's okay. Don't ask if he's okay. Do you want to talk about it? His emotion said that he was like tired of people asking him that. Okay. It, it's your fault. Definitely don't give me that fine. attitude. Oh, you're the bridge from the very beginning. There he is. Nervous? I'm so fucked. Oh, he can't hide from me forever, Mac. Why is he thinking that? I don't know, but Mac. he's done. Alex. Look, it's not a good time. You owe me an explanation about what happened to Kate. Didn't ask. What? Costing me my girlfriend wasn't enough for you? Now you're gonna accuse me of killing Gabe, too? I just want to know what happened, Mac. No, Drop you, the you, act. You know he's full of shit. I know you've been lying about that night. You don't know shit. Mac, come on. Is he taking Who's the fall for brother? someone else? I can't. Taking the fall for Ryan. Something definitely has him scared. Maybe if I could tap into his fear, I could get to the truth. I have to, uh, this ain't gonna go well. All right, why is it gonna give me full control? I need to find control? something I could use to push him over the edge. Wait, what? How about you literally push him over the edge? How about I literally push him over the edge? Yeah, but I need to talk to Riley about Max's fear. So, where, where is Riley? Probably not in the back of the store. Actually, I'm thinking, where does Riley work? Which Life of Strange was it that had, like, the weird rich kid that drugged and raped people? No, that was the first one, which I don't have on my YouTube channel. So, we're going to do the remastered version of it once it uh, comes Someone out. died up in the ravine a few days ago. 
That's all you care about? Mm -hmm. About your stupid hiking trip? <laughs> That's all you care about is your stupid hiking trip. Pretty cool. How is that, like, remotely helpful? It's pretty cool that they added that in. Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. Yeah, but where where does Riley work, or where would Riley be right? Now? Isn't she like in college, just text her or something? No, no, she stayed. Remember? No, I didn't see that. Brown bear diner? No, but oh, the cat. There it is. Well, I just want to be friends. I can't pet the cat still. Val, I just want to be friends. Oh, okay. Trash game, honestly. <laughs> Trash game, honestly, because you can't pet the cat, yeah. I don't get it. Do people just I can't go this not way, want can ice cream I? anymore? I looked over the budget. If we only open three days a week, we'll be able to scrape by. Is that it? Are we always just going to scrape by? Things will get better. Pirate you have to keep up a brave face for Angela. She loves our store so much. He must be exhausted. We're losing our business. But it's like everything's a joke to him. She must feel so alone. Hope they figure it out. I can't like do anything to help them. Push Damn the rum it. raisin harder. It's surprisingly addictive. You haven't been putting you have your own problem in it again wait what uh, no wait yeah i'm gonna end up cutting a bunch of this out aren't i most likely oh wait is this because i saw at the very beginning of the game there was a they called it a zen moment Do I even want to stay here without Gabe? In this state I've no. never been to before. This town I've been in for less than a week. Not that I know where else I'd even go. Back to the nothing waiting for me in Portland. Fuck. I have no idea what comes next. But I'm not leaving here without answers about Gabe. At least I know that. I feel like the answer is going to be so obvious, and I'm just going to be so sad about it. Wait a minute. You're dumb. I want you to be aware of that. Literally, don't even come back in the room. I literally room. walked right past here and I didn't check. <laughs> I feel so bad. Okay. He's nervous as well? If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? That's... Acting like what? Maybe I can get her to tell me. New dialogue were... unlocked. They had that in the, the first game as well. Nice. Hey. What's up, bitch? Hey! Don't be mean to her! Gabe, Eleanor... Gotta run. You <laughs> and Eleanor are so run. close. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. But I just like, hey, Riley, hey, I've I gotta never really run. Knew my mom. Hey, Riley, gotta run. She's always been there for me. <laughs> so stupid, but... What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. Will she be alright? Will she be alright without you? No, don't ask that. She's a tough cookie. Don't ask that in your but for a second. I do worry about her sometimes. She's getting older. One day I'll have to take care of her. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. She at least deserves to know, but like, yeah. it's not my place to tell her. To both of us.
All right, let's ask about Gabe. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him so much. I like how her hair physics are completely unrealistic because she's tilting her head and is still staying to her face. Well, she has a pony She's like an older so... brother to me. Well, no, not her. Oh, you're talking about Alex. Yeah. I'm glad he had you. I look at this angle, right? Her yeah. head's tilted down. Looks Thank over you, her Alex. Face, like attached to really? her face. Super glue. Old hair gel, not super glue. Hair glow. That fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of them, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all yeah, this... That, that makes sense. I can see that they were right. You think Mac ignored Gabe's call? Do you think he could have ignored Gabe's call? I mean, do you think he's capable of that? I don't want to believe that, but... Sorry, I'm really not ready to talk about it. Raph! You don't have the place to say that. Right, the extra yeah. dialogue option that I unlocked. I get it. It's just... If he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? Like, obviously, though, the story's gonna go that it's not his fault. Like, someone's paid him off from him. He asked me to Company leave with him. What? Right after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. I told him no, and that we were done. And now, I'm scared he did something horrible. Really? That's definitely weird. Thank you for telling me. I'm to go you interrogate the him. Get the flashlight. <laughs> Get the flashlight. I'd rather go for There's the car battery and clamps. To do. Okay. See, the flashlight has multiple uses, right? True. We'll talk soon. Wow, that was fast. <laughs> soon? Yeah. Oh. Whenever you want. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. Alright, you want to try this? Let, let's Thanks do this. Thanks for spending time with me. Oh, I wanted to sit down Thanks again before I just me. say gotta run. <laughs> That's not a thing I could do. God damn it. Oh, uh, I guess I lost my chance earlier. Holy crap, that's a lot of red. Yikes. Okay, 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 chill out, dude. <laughs> okay, then! Uh... Okay. I think that's a okay. visual bug, but... No, he's just that mad. <laughs> he's just that mad. <laughs> why? I, why is he so angry? Is that just? Yeah, is that Trevor from GT? Is this this is the fourth time you've walked past? What the heck? Then again, you were supposed to spend this much time in this area. I don't think so. I should make sure Definitely there's nothing not. else I want to do before I confront Mac. Okay, is there anything else we want to do? No, we already finished all of that. Imagine he just whipped out a gun. Oh. Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ryan, even Riley. Fuck! Good. He's scared. Time to find out the truth. Alright, let's try this. What Riley told me might do it. But I should make sure there isn't anything I still you, want to do around town earlier. first. Ready. Okay, let's do this. Your ex-girlfriend told me about your plans to skip town. Oh dear. That's not something innocent that's, people do. That's purple though, not red, so. Oh God, it's not. 
I didn't do anything. Well, you're certainly hiding something. <sighs> Fuck off! Oh. Leave me alone! <sighs> what is he so nervous she, about? She could have, like, an empathetic heart attack. I don't know if that's a thing, but... Um... What? Uh... Hi! I guess this is Mac. Mac's feeling? This is what Mac's like feeling about the world, yeah. Oh. That everything- a Typhoon Mining is watching him? Covering up for them. Fuck. I'll deal with Mac when I get to him. For now, I need to learn everything I can. Alright, tell me about this. Typhoon's always watching. They run this whole town. Typhoon's walk. Yeah, I didn't think it was Mac. Mac I feels think... like everyone's staring at him. Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. Love it since I'm killed by loser. <laughs> I don't ever murder somebody or that'll be your headline. Yeah. Got him. It's not fair. You keep your mouth shut about Game Jen's death. I'm gonna have to pause this on the, like the way back or slow it down, uh, just to see all of this. Typhoon Mining recommends you keep your mouth shut about Gabe Chen's death for the rest of your life. Warnings will not be given. Make one mistake, we will find you. Do not tell a soul. We are always watching. The so typhoon definitely I did saw something Mac about run down that alley. That alley? Hold on. What's this? Oh, it's... It should have been you instead! You Alex? Dead? Wrong. Oh, shit. No! What the hell? There are people out there! No, I told you to call it off! All the way they look to me at the wake. They all think I let him die. I know why you're lying. Um. Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. Don't say, "Oh, you're stupid." That was right, though, like, according to his own emotions. Yeah, but, like, you shouldn't have said that. You should have said that, like, you made a mistake or something, because you know they're watching him. You're guilty, too, option? or don't take the fall? No, he's guilty, too. Fuck him. I'm... <sighs> I want to say don't take the fall, because then he can testify against Typhoon. And he gets money, we don't want him to get money. True. You might not have been the reason he died, but you covering for their fuck-up makes you guilty too. You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose. Why didn't you tell Why? anyone that? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever a call. You gotta believe me. According to his own emotions he about might. the other things around us, though. I, I didn't want him dead. And now, and now Typhon's watching me. My girlfriend, she, she thinks I'm a murderer? My neighbors all hate you're me. You're ex. Oh my god, you're ex. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Wow, well, that was... okay. I think I can calm that him down. That rope's looking pretty good, to be honest. Does he deserve it? I think I can calm him down, but does he deserve it? No, I think we need it. 
I think we need to calm him down so that he can testify to the police, right? Like, if we walk away, he'll probably end up committing suicide. And, well, problem solved. But... That's the good ending. But we know it wasn't just his fault, though. We know it was multiple people's fault. Uh, Hey, man, if he's gonna take the fall, he might as well take the fall, you know what I mean? (laughs) Fall all the way? No. I, I want to calm him down to make sure that he can testify and help me find everyone else who's guilty for this. Alright. Mac. Come on. You gotta calm down, okay? Dude. Stay with me. I know what it's like to be doubted. To have everyone... Think the worst of you. But the truth will come out. You really though? I'll make sure of it. But Typhon. If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? The teenage girl, yeah. Super strong defense. Thanks. Actually, because you asked, how old is I'm assuming she's 18 because she doesn't have like parents. (laughs) At least 18, because she's yeah, no longer well, in the foster care. You learn a thing or two hanging out with shrinks your whole life. <laughs> How old is... So... What are you gonna do now? Don't leave Haven. I'm gonna get to the truth. I see you typing rule 34. No, that's not what I'm typing, and you know it. You asked uh, how old she was. She's 21, which makes sense. Cause she's 21? No Jesus in, Christ. She's no longer in the foster care system, so that makes sense. I definitely thought she was like 19, Max. He's older than I am, which I wasn't expecting, but okay. Yeah, I know, she hey. looked like 19. She was 21. Yeah, it's... It's like a two-year difference. Can we talk? Where are you? Oh. Who is she okay. um, I don't know. Uh, frankly, don't care. I'm going to leave because I have to get up at five. Okay. See ya. I'm going to probably keep going with this through like episode three or something like that. You do that. Bye. By by Alex. Well, one of the Alexes, I guess. Yes, no says he vibing. He definitely was, so I hope he can recover enough to testify against Typhoon. Oh dear. Ryan? No, don't you dare. No, bad Ryan. You were right. About Typhon, about Mac. Alex. Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. He told me. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine and... It doesn't matter! Oh dear, that that's a lot of red. I keep coming here. He blames himself back. because he cut the row. But it always ends the same. Ryan. He's dead. He's really dead, Alex. Well, I mean, we didn't find a body, though, so... I- is he? This is a terrible plan. Oh dear. This was definitely a bad idea. (laughs) 
I am the superior, Alex, Alien says. Well, last I checked, fault. you didn't have superpowers. My job but... is to keep people safe. Wait, and I do failed. you actually have... Never mind. Saved Ethan, you saved me. Typhon did this. You did everything right. Typhon took him away from us. Not you. I keep saying it was Typhoon. It's only one She's oh. wrong. I let her cross that log. I put Gabe in harm's way. I'm not a hero. I'm a coward. Worse than worthless. You were brave this morning. You're brave now. I've never been as brave as you. It doesn't matter. Gabe's dead. Because of me. I mean, I do blame him, but he did also Gabe, save me and I'm so sorry. Ethan in the process. Gabe loved you, Ryan. He would forgive you. You know that. That might have been the wrong You're one. You're not alone. Because he was going towards that edge there. <laughs> Please don't let this... Okay, good. Please don't let this be the second time someone's jumped off a high place in a Life is Strange game. By the way, it's right you guys aren't using the new sound alerts and everything, because there were some good ones. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hold on. <laughs> There's a guy in a gorilla suit? <laughs> Does he also jump off of the cliff and into the pool? No, no, he chases a guy in a banana suit. That guy jumps off the cliff and into the pool. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. This is a Mexican restaurant? Eh, nominally. <laughs> <laughs> the food is, uh, well, terrible. But it's Gabe's favorite place. <laughs> I tell you, he's the oldest 12-year-old I know. Okay, maybe I was wrong about the idea of them working together to kidnap Gabe. Can I, ask I you something? don't think Gabe's actually dead. Of course. You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac. About him getting the call. Oh, no. How did you know? Don't, 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 don't do it. Don't make me choose again. Don't make me choose There's again. There's something you should know uh, about me. And it's going to be easier to show you. Well, it you didn't make me choose again, it. but like. This is going to seem sort of weird at first. Then really weird. Do you trust me? Think of something. Let's do scary. Okay. Think of something that just scares the shit out of you. Really focus until you feel it. Mac, Typhon, all of it. You're afraid you won't know how to handle it without Gabe. Never knew anyone so good at getting into and out of trouble. <laughs> oh, man. Wait, that's a Just different color aura around him. <laughs> I, we haven't seen gold yet. <laughs> Whatever it is you're thinking about right now, don't stop, okay? Keep going. 
Okay. <laughs> what emotion is this? Yeah, we haven't seen this. <laughs> Oh, no way. <laughs> Gabe. Goose. I see it. It'll move. It's not moving. It'll move. Gabe! <laughs> okay, th this is a pretty cool sequence. What about this one? Oh, that's a lot of blood, huh? Gabe, this is serious. Killing a Canadian goose is a violation of international law. Shut up. It is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. Property of the crown. The, the crown of... Property of the crown, Gabe. What do we do? He ran over a Canadian goose with his car... And they, they buried it. How deep you think? Deeper than that. The Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces. The Mounties? Oh, come on, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, I don't know why that was supposed to let me be a dig? funny memory, but... I wasn't going to stop you. <laughs> they they straight up killed the goose and made a funny memory so, out of it. <laughs> did you finish burying the goose or not? <laughs> okay, also, property of the crown. <laughs> really? <laughs> well, they are technically protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. <laughs> Basically, some kind of freak. There's just something wrong with the way I process other people's emotions. I see these auras, I guess. And sometimes, if somebody's feeling something big, it sort of infects me and I start feeling it too and that's what you just did with with me <laughs> there's nothing wrong with you you're a literal wizard it's it's only ever been the bad emotions before but that, that was pure joy. Who else knows? Gabe did. But now I guess just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call, and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to toe the line. Okay, but... why? I don't know yet. Someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Seems like finding out who would be a good start. So, you're going after Typhon? Yep. Let's do it. You'll need help.
You don't have to. You're stuck with me now. Oh, well. I'm always gonna do that. You're welcome, I guess. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. No. Thank you. This one's for you, Gabe. I miss you. I really should have a hotkey to turn the camera off during moments like this. I'm gonna have to work on that. I appreciate the gesture of the lantern and everything. I didn't but speak this morning. These things I cause couldn't. forest fires. Hearing everyone talk about him, about the life he had here with all of you. I lost the chance to have that. But even though I only had one day with him, he changed my life. I said, I didn't know if I belonged here. He told me that home isn't something you find. It's something you build. That was part two. Most everyone did calm back down from his panic attack. We did remind Eleanor what happened. If we didn't visit Charlotte, she 100% would have signed the agreement. 0% of people did that. Zero. Not one person did that. Charlotte didn't take Typhon's money. Most people did enjoy a quiet moment on the dock. 
We did tidy up the mess in the apartment. Oh, damn it. Oh, we could have added something to the memory table. We could have we could have written on the dartboard. There would have been other choices to go by other names for the LARP. We didn't sit at the table. Alex admitted that she didn't hear Gabe's call, which was correct. We didn't hear it, just that he said that he did make the call. No matter what, Ryan wouldn't have jumped off. So that's good. I let Steph play. I, I let her. I, I lost. I, she beat me fair and square. It would have been possible to help the bird watcher find the hawk, but we didn't. Zero percent of people didn't talk to Steph, which is really weird. We could have helped the sad dude find his dog, but we didn't. Oh well. Anyway, if you're watching, see you on the next episode.